Hi everybody, we are on location outside of the Imagination Station and we are doing something really cool. I have no idea what's going to happen. Carl, what are we doing today? We're talking about liquid nitrogen. Okay. You know, that's one of my favorite, favorite things. things. 320 degrees below zero and it's boiling at that temperature. So it's a really cool cryogenic liquid. And I thought, you know, like a classic demonstration with liquid nitrogen. Uh -huh. Go ahead and put your gloves on. Yeah, you know, I was thinking, Carl, you're Is, making me nervous. You take a flower. Sure. Flowers are filled with cells that have water in them. And what I want you to do is once you get your gloves on, um, dip this right into this container right here, All slowly. Right. And we're gonna lower the temperature of the water inside those cells in the flower. Dip it? Yeah, just push it right down in there. Yeah, perfect, right there. Hold it right there for a few, few seconds. Okay. Um, and you can do a little bit of crinkling. Yep, going. just get from the it's, This is like store. plastic tubing from like a home supply store. Sure. This has no water in it. Right. Okay, so the question is what's gonna happen when this gets very, very cold? And we're gonna- Oh, I think I know the answer to this. We're gonna see what happens. See, I think I think we're getting there. We've seen like very little nitrogen coming out the top Sure, now. at first it was shooting out. Shooting okay. out like a fountain. So grab this mallet. I'm gonna put this on the table and I want you to just smash the end of it that was okay. in the nitrogen. All so, right. Okay, give it a whack. Harder, harder. Oh! There we go. Breaks like glass, okay? That was because very therapeutic. Became very brittle, okay? okay? So now other things like fruit and vegetables have lots of water in them. Okay. Before we started, I actually put a zucchini down inside. Go ahead and smash that. Let's oh, just, oh, with it's, this? It's falling apart. Okay. Yeah, hit it. Oh boy. Hit it again. Oh, right. this is so fun. I could do this now, all day. I've heard that onions are really interesting. And for this one, I think step up to the bigger mallet. Oh boy. Okay. okay. All right. So go ahead and give that a whack with the sledgehammer there. All right. Ready? Well, let me get this out of the way. Okay. okay. Go. One, two, three. Woo. Wow. That sounded and like an ornament. It did. It sounded, sounded like, like a Christmas ornament. Mm -hmm. Now, the logical extension of all this sort of smashing of stuff sure. would be to take something that's a lot bigger and put it in a container of liquid nitrogen. All right. So down here, inside this big cooler, this has been cooling for a few minutes now. All right. We've got a really large piece of fruit. Go ahead and take what this out. What do we out. have in here? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We've got a watermelon. Oh, OK. OK. Normal. Now. You could use this sledgehammer, uh -huh. but I, I got something special for you. Oh, yay. We made a much <laughs> larger mallet, okay? Now, I don't know sure. if you remember Gallagher yes. from a long time ago. Well, all I need you to do is basically drop this baby on top of that watermelon. All right. And let's just see what happens. Okay. So, but you know what? Let me get some of this out of the way. All right. Now, should I put some force behind this? Why not? All right. Just, just whack it as hard as you can. Just, All right, this is kind of awkward. Good, get a good grip. Okay, got a good grip. Ready? Ready? One, two, three. Right. Oh, wow. Now, what's cool about this is, even though that watermelon was in there for like five, 10 minutes, yeah. only the outer inch or so actually froze. Sure, the inside, the inside is still, is still, still liquidy. fruity. Still fruity. Mm. And it's still good. Good? Yeah. Extra cold? It's a little bit cool. Okay. Just don't put your tongue on that part because it'll probably stick. Oh, but, yeah. There's so many cool things you can do when you lower the temperature of something, freeze the water inside, or even change its physical properties like that uh, plastic tubing. Yeah. It became very, very brittle, all with liquid nitrogen. Very cool. Well, wow, you definitely amped it up today. <laughs> Took me by surprise. <laughs> Fun stuff like this is always happening down here at the Imagination Station. I feel kind of like a Muppet right now with these giant hands. <laughs> you can come on down here to the Imagination Station. It is Saturday. That means that children 12 and under get in free that live in Lucas County with a paid adult. And that's how you imagine it.